hey guys what's up and welcome back to my channel in today's video I'm just gonna simply get ready I have a brunch to go to in about maybe less than an hour I have to leave so I'm just really just about to put on some makeup to go to this brunch it's Sunday I want to look simple but cute so yeah if you want to see me get ready make sure you keep on watching <laughs> So I have my hair up for right now and my bonnet on just so I can keep my hair out the way while I put on makeup. It's hard putting on makeup with a wig. Like, it's too much. So of course I'm going to start off with this primer. And it's the Tatcha Silk Canvas Primer. And I need this because, one, my skin has been having some issues these days. Um, as far as like I had a bad breakout here from I think it was like almost like an allergic reaction to something and then I just haven't been drinking as much water as I should so my life um, but I'm also wearing a radiant foundation so I need my skin to be a little bit on the matte side as far as priming goes and this does the job pretty well. So I'm gonna spread that all over my face and then foundation. Okay, I'm gonna wipe away this like excess white stuff that this sometimes does. Okay. Now I'm gonna take this NARS Radiant, Naturally Radiant Foundation in the shade, I think, Macau. This is actually my first time using this, so hopefully it's as bomb as everybody says it is. But I'm just going to put a little bit on the back of my palm. Um, and yeah, I'm going to put it on. Okay, so I just put on like a light layer. Again, it's brunch. I don't need nothing too heavy. Um, so now I'm going to go in with concealer. Today I'm going to use the L'Oreal Infallible Full Wear Concealers. Um, I'm using the shade 415 Honey to highlight with and 445 Ex Espresso to contour with. I think I'm going to contour first because to me, contouring first makes the contour cleaner because then I can like clean it up with the highlight. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Alright, so now I'm taking this Urban Decay All Nighter Spray. I'm just going to spray it um, just to merge everything and then blend it out with my Sonny Cash Sponge. This is just like phase one of my face, basically. Alright, so the sponge looks super stiff because I didn't wet it because I didn't feel like getting up. So, make sure your sponge is damp. Um, however, next I'm going in with the Huda Beauty Easy Bake Under, what is it? Easy Bake Setting Powder in the shade Kun Kunafa. Um, yeah, this is one of my favorite setting powders, but it is pretty, like, I would say it's drier than, it's the driest powder. No, it's not the driest powder that I have. It's the second driest powder that I have, but since again I'm using a um, radiant foundation, I want to add a little bit of some matte products just so I'm not slipping and sliding everywhere. And again, it's my first time trying this foundation, so I'm not trying to play no games at brunch, okay? Okay, so now I'm taking this CoverGirl Queen Collection um, foundation powder in the shade Medium Q420. Um, I'm just going to take a little bit of this and set my entire face. 
with a powder brush if I can find it. All right, so now I'm going in with this Anastasia Beverly Hills bronzer. I legitimately forgot that I had this. Um, yeah, so it's in the shade Mahogany. So I'm going to go ahead and put some bronzer on. But I'm using this as like a contour, not really a bronzer. So I'm not going to sweep it all over my face. I am going to put it in the contours of my cheek and on my forehead and chin like I would a contour powder. With this same brush, I'm going to dip into the Fenty bronzer and pretty much mix the two, putting it on the same places that I put the Anastasia Beverly Hills bronzer. And this is the shade Coconati. I'm just going to lightly tap. All right, literally taking the same no, I'm not going to do the same brush. I'm going to switch it. I'm going to go into the Maybelline Fit Me blush in the shade 60, I think this is. And I'm going to add some blush. Now, again, I'm taking the Urban Decay All Nighter again. And I'm just going to spray to set everything in place once again. And I just want to add a little bit of highlight, definitely not on my chin because it's already broken out there. So I'm just going to sweep a little bit of highlight. This is the, my bad, this is the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, Omrezi highlight. Haven't used this in a minute either, so only a little bit though. Okay, so that gave me a nice set of glow. Okay, so now I'm going to do some work on the eyes. I think I'm just going to keep it simple for the most part. So I think I'm going to start with Nostalgia. This is the I Love Sahir Sarahi X ColourPop um, Through My Eyes Collection palette. Haven't used this also in a minute. So I'm pulling out all the oldies but goodies. So I'm going to go into Nostalgia first. Next, I'm going into the shade Misbehave, which is a darker pink shade, and I'm going like right over where I put Nostalgia. I'm going to take Misbehave, which is the shade that I just put on, um, and I'm going to put that on the lower lash line. Now I'm going to take the shade Flex from the palette and I'm just going to put that on the lid. Okay, so first I'm going to take this Makeup Forever um, liner pencil in the shade Whatever Black 100 and I'm going to line my um, waterline as well as my like lash line at the top. I'm going to also go in with the, um, what is it? This new Milk Kush Mascara, Waterproof Mascara, my bad. Um, I was sent this from Influencer, so I'm trying it out for the first time. So I'm going to put these two on and then also the Ardell Faux Mink 3D Lash, 3D Faux Mink Lashes in the style 853. I'm um, just going to pop those on and then, so when I come back, my eyes should be just about done yeah so now I'm back and I'm gonna use this Mac night moth lip pencil to line my lips and then this Pat McGrath flesh for gloss to put kind of over the top
Alright, so now I'm just going to go put my hair on and I will be back. Alright guys, so here is the final look. I am about to head out and hurry up and get dressed so that I can make it to brunch one time. Thank you so much for watching this video. Everything will be listed down below as far as like what I used today. And yeah, if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next video.